Hey guys, welcome back. So what's the easiest way you can boot multiple ISO images from a single USB drive? So, I mean, in the old days, you would get your ISO image, you would then get a USB drive, format the USB drive, and then effectively burn the ISO image onto that USB drive. And if you wanted to have multiple images, it really was a complicated procedure. However, with this new method, I'm gonna be sharing with you today, all you have to do is use this application to format your USB drive. And once your drive is formatted, you can literally just drag across any ISO images you want onto your USB drive. And this application will take care of the booting process as well. So you can drag across Windows images, Linux images, any ISO images that can boot, just drag it to your USB drive and all of the boot management process will be done with this application. And it really is as easy as that. Now to start the process, the application in question is called uh, Ventoy. And let's just open up a browser. Here it is. Let's click on the first link. Let's go to downloads. And of course, this is a completely free application. Let's download the zip file. Scroll down and click on the zip file again. Here's the application there. Let's now open that up. Let's expand the zip file or we'll just drag it out. Let's open that up again. And let's now click on this. Click on yes. It then shows you whichever USB drive you plugged in and make sure you do select the right drive. So here is my 32 gig Kingston drive. For example, I can now click on install. Click on yes again. Yes, one more time. This will now format the disk for you, then install that Ventoy booting software. That's now formatted. I can now close this down. And here is the USB drive. So I can now drag across any ISO images which are bootable into this folder or into this drive. And they will then automatically boot when I plug this into another computer. So it literally is as easy as that. So for this demonstration, let me drag across uh, some ISOs. Okay, so I've just dragged across two ISO images. We have a Windows 10 image and also an ISO of the Linux Manjaro distribution. So the only thing you have to be wary of is make sure there's no spaces in the name for the ISO file. So we can see both of mine are okay. And that's pretty much it guys. I can now eject this from my computer and whichever computer I plug it in, I should now be able to boot these two ISOs automatically. So let's try that now. And let's just shut this down. And just like that guys, booting with this USB drive, we now get to see the Ventoy boot menu and the two ISO images are dragged across to the USB drive. We can now select them in here. So that's how easy it is guys. So you can literally just load up all of your favorite ISOs, different operating systems, different utilities. As long as the ISO is bootable, you can drag it across to your USB drive and this Ventoy will automatically present that into this boot menu here. So let's say for example, I want to boot into the Linux Manjaro. I can click on that. And that will then boot that instantly for me. So that's all for this video, guys. Many thanks for watching. Do let me apologize that I haven't actually posted a video for a while, but I am trying to sort out my time management issues. So I will be posting more videos regularly on here as well. So if you did find this video useful, then do give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more stuff like this, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. As always, I always appreciate your likes, your shares, your comments. So do let me know what you think. Leave me a comment below and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.